We're already starting to get orders and we're behind the curve as it is. We're growing something, okay? All the beautiful, bodacious boards. Show me your socks. Such a needy, needy boy. You win. Naughty, naughty. Trying to prepare for the 2022 holiday season because welcome to another Jenny and Davis video where Caleb begins the edit. In my Bucky shirt. In his Bucky shirt. Look, show me your socks. You got Yay. color coordinated cherry socks. Cherry socks? Caleb always comes in and he's just <laughs> perfectly coordinated. It's absolutely incredible. Caitlin, you don't have any socks. No. Wearing sandals. <laughs> Wearing sandals. <laughs> I would show your feet, but I don't know if you get mad at me for that. <laughs> Bruce, how are you feeling this morning? Are you feeling extra inspired today? Look at how yeah, look at how pitiful this dog acts. Such a needy, needy boy. Anyway, today is gonna be crazy. We are so behind. We already got our first holiday order in, and I we're just frankly behind on everything. I got a magical sticky note here that's gonna tell me all the things I need to do today. And the first thing is fulfill boards. So turn the fans on and hopefully we can get done before it turns a thousand degrees here in the shop. I have four boards to do. I can't show you the paper because it's got personal information on it. But one customer didn't put the full address. They just put like the the number and like the street name which that could go anywhere and it was a very common address so naughty naughty fill out your request link correctly but we've got a wide variety of boards to do today we have a sunset cutting board a cutting board where they didn't choose so i'll just choose another sunset board because we have more of those and i have a walnut charcuterie board and i have a cherry charcuterie board comments about this all the time people ask what the blue tape is for and that's to find the exact center of the board so that when I align the engraving on the laser that it's perfectly centered on the board it only took a minute and 30 seconds to do four boards and the charcuterie boards have to be done twice so it really doesn't take that much time a lot of y'all have been recommending a jig or something like that and thank you for the suggestion but click Click, 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 click. We are trying to prepare for the 2022 holiday season because our cutting and charcuterie boards make amazing gifts. And we want to be able to sell anyone who wants these boards for their gifts some boards. So we got to make sure that when we try to optimize something that it's actually worth optimizing. Because when we're doing 40 and 50 boards a day, it's going to start to really add up all the time consuming steps. And there's some things like finding the center of these boards with the blue tape that just doesn't really take all that much time because things like stuffing crinkle paper around the edges of the boards, that takes a lot longer than a minute and a half per board. So we've got some other procedures and systems we're trying to optimize there, but you gotta pick and choose your battles. And that's what we're trying to figure out with the holiday season. We're just not to the point where I need to save a task that only takes a minute and 30 seconds. We got a lot more tasks that could be optimized. I just can't waste my time on something that's that insignificant. And admittedly, when I start to think about doing this like 50 times in one day, I get really overwhelmed. Look at what this dog contributes. This dog does not care. It is impossible to annoy him. We've tried. We've sat in the living room for like an hour doing everything we can to, to annoy him and it just can't be done. He does not care. He just loves all the attention. Such a needy, needy boy. Well, 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 well. Our customer finally replied back with the address she wanted the board shipped to, so I guess I have another board to do today. I could kick it till tomorrow and really make her learn her lesson, but it's really not that big of a deal. She wants cutting board. How's this one look? Does everyone approve of this cutting board? Is it up to your standards? You know, I love shipping boards because it means that our customers are going to buy more from us in the future. Jenny has a 100% success rate when she tries to sell them to re-up their order. People love our product once they actually use it. So I don't mind being overwhelmed with board orders because that just means we're gonna make more money in the future. Boop. I don't know why this is so satisfying, but I just absolutely love pulling the lever on this tape machine, chopping the tape and putting it on the box. I would turn the fan on because it's getting hot in here, but I'm filming and I wanna be able to talk to you. So just know that I'm suffering for you. You could leave a comment and say, thank you, Davis, for being such a wonderful host in this video. Thank you, Davis, for all the content you produce. Thank you, Davis, for being a great visionary and business leader in the Houston area. Thank you, Davis, for being so humble and wonderful. And thank you for sharing your pets with us and your story and all the blessings that you have. Thank you for sharing the overflow with us. You could say that. 
or you could not. Up to you. No pressure. Such a needy, needy boy. I've had it with this fake leather chair in this hot warehouse, changing it out for a mesh chair. It's just, it's sticky and sweaty and gross and nobody wants to see that. <sighs> Much better. Now I don't get butt sweat everywhere. Is the Texas heat insufferable? Are you constantly thinking about how sweaty you are instead of getting work done? Millions of Americans suffer from swamp every year in the South, and we can end that today with our new product, the Samara Table Company Mesh Chair. We make these by hand in our Houston factory, and we can ship it directly to you. The mesh chair is not available anywhere in stores. It's not actually made in a Houston warehouse or facility. It's actually made by a company called Uline that Jenny Davis really like and appreciate, but maybe you could buy their stuff and maybe one day we'll work out a sponsorship deal if you guys buy enough stuff from Uline on their behalf. Mesh chair has not been clinically proven to reduce any of the symptoms Davis talked about. Please don't take it seriously. This is just a joke. Bye. And that's the last board finished. That's my favorite time where I get to look at all the beautiful, bodacious boards that we have. First up, we got the Gem Rose family. Congratulations on your new cherry charcuterie board, complete with interesting burl knot thing that I've filled with epoxy. It looks beautiful. It'll look really good when we finish it. Where in the world does that name come from? The next we got the Gaudens or Godens or something. I don't know. The Gaudens. It sounds very prim and proper. Or it's Louisiana and it's Gaudens. And it, you just gotta say it with a little bit of scruff in your voice. I don't know. They're probably nice people. Then we got the Choi family. I can't think of any jokes that aren't gonna get me canceled. Good people, the Choi's. Then we got home. You know, this is a little bit interesting for a last name. I don't know what symbol that is on the keyboard, but um, you know what? Sometimes with these foreign names, you get what you get, and there's just not really a way to translate it. So then we got the Slepikas. Fun fact, I just looked it up. The Slepika family actually migrated here from Russia about 30 years ago. There's maybe three dozen families in the U.S. stateside, but they used to be Russian spies. It was really interesting. I got a fascinating history, and I just made all that up. It's hot. The battery's about to die, and my patience has run out. You will see me when the boards are finished. Look, look, look. Look at this little notebook. Isn't that cute? So I found these notebooks online and I just slapped a smart sticker on them and now they look really cute and like brand cohesive. I hired a new salesperson. He's coming in today. It's his first day. I really hope he likes it here, but I got him a new desk and I set up a new chair. We bought lots of new desks that all match and we got new chairs from Target. And this one I moved out and now this whole room is uh, this whole room is turning into just one big storage area and it's not supposed to be. It's supposed to be my photo studio and now it's an absolute disaster and I'm just super overwhelmed because I've got so much stuff to do and where am I supposed to find time to make sales for the 2022 holiday season that's coming up in just a few months. I just got a lot going on. Very overwhelmed and uh, I feel very behind. I hired a new salesperson. It's his first day today. That's another thing I have to do is just train a couple new people um, which is way more work than you think it is. <laughs> But as overwhelmed and as behind as I am and I feel, uh, I do have to step back for a moment and just appreciate everything that's going on right now. Yes, it's a lot, training new employees and constantly doing interviews and hiring, but that's exactly what we've been wanting to happen in this business. This is good. We're growing. And I'm so excited that the holiday season is coming up because now we have a ton of sales and leads that we can really dig into, especially the new sales members. Um, so it's good. And I'm so thankful. And I'm so excited for October, November, and December to roll around. Um, it's just, it's a lot going on, but big picture. I am so joyful that it's all happening. But in all seriousness, I need to have one of these desks set up before 11 a.m. today. Yeah. We're growing something, okay? Hey, yo, come here. Come here. You win. Hey, we're back and check out how beautiful all these boards are. They look so nice. I'll show you guys more of the finishing process and like putting the feet on, but like sometimes we have realtors information on the back. And some of you yahoos have called our previous customers and just wasted their time. I, I don't understand it. Anyway, I can't show phone numbers from the back of the boards because um, YouTube is YouTube. So thank you for all those of you that are grown ups and don't do things like that. We got a new roll of paper and it's so much easier to tear because it's got weight and I can, I have something to pull against. Every time I fold these boxes, it makes me think of a pizza box and then that makes me hungry. Normally I'd have help today, but 
Sid's not coming in today. And then Adi went to go be a doctor or something because he thinks he's better than the rest of us. But Jenny is training a new salesperson today and I don't know if I'm allowed to show you. Thumbs up if you want to see him. Okay, we got all four of the boards ready to go. We got a fifth one here that Jenny is going to take to an event to be auctioned off. And it is 11 a.m. and I've only accomplished the first task on my little list today. Go me. But that's okay, we're going to get it all done. Hello. Special delivery. Thank you. Who's going to get it? Uh, the realtor that has bought like 105 boards from us so far. She's great. She's the best. Bruce has made quick friends with Austin. <laughs> I'm your sales guy. Say hi, Hello. Austin. Hello. What's your name? Austin Brown. And what do you do? I am a sales rep. <laughs> great job. <laughs> All right, y'all have fun. Bye. Well, I'm back from the UPS store and Caleb is heating up his lunch. What'd you bring for lunch? I brought leftover mod. Pizza? Mod pizza. Mod pizza. I get like almost every meat that you can. All the meats? All of the meats. Nice. Excellent choice. Any veggies? No. Pizza, pizza does not belong on veg... <laughs> Veg so, vegetables does not belong on pizza. You heard it from the source. But I just got back from the UPS store because we had a box get returned to sender. The real estate agent gave us the wrong address, which I'll let that joke make itself. Um, but anyway, this is what our boxes look like when they come back to sender. So keep in mind, this has been through the mail twice as far as it should have because it was returned. Box is a little beat up, but that's why we do two boxes instead of one. So I'm gonna unpack this, probably give it a new shipping box, slap the correct label on it and send it out. It honestly doesn't look too bad. This is the first time we've had to return to sender since we started using these boxes. The interior box still looks flawless. Uh, crinkle paper doesn't look mushed or smushed. It actually looks like I just box it up. So that's great. We'll uh, put it in a new... There we go. Just needs a new label and it'll be out the door. I've always been worried about the charcuterie boards because they're smaller. I'm always worried they're going to just like jump around everywhere, but that one actually stayed really secure. So that was a great check to see how our packaging does. Um, we always get a thousand questions on where we get our boxes and packaging from. We get the shipping boxes from Uline and then we get these from a company that does custom printed mailer boxes. We've ordered from two or three companies. They, I think they all use the same manufacturer. So literally the, it does not matter. They're all the same price. They're all the same quality. Just do a Google search for custom printed mailer boxes and pick a company, design your box. And yes, they're expensive unless you order several hundred at a time. So that's it. There's no secret. What do you want? It's just pork. You don't like pork. Who's ever heard of a dog that likes pork? See? Ugh, gross. Yeah, you don't want this. All right, it's after lunch and it is time to film some Tiki Talkies. Yes, we have a TikTok account. So, Caitlin and Caleb helping me here because my tiny brain can only hold on to three words at a time. And on TikTok, you gotta say a lot more really fast. And so, they're trying to help me out. This is the set, do you like it? Kids have a huge advantage over adults in selling. Get out there and learn how to do sales and use this advantage while you still have time. It's already 3.50. I got 10 minutes left and I only got two things done on my list today. We had just, it's okay. You know, Matt Cremona told me one time, he said, you're just gonna have to be okay with not getting everything done that you wanna get done because you're never gonna feel like you did enough no matter what you did and that's okay. You gotta learn to be okay with that feeling. And I feel like we're slowly getting there. I'm so happy that we have enough work, that we are busy and that we are making sales and, and having to, to build and ship boards because that means that the business is growing and it's doing well. I need to get out of my own head and just be happy that I have these problems because if I didn't have these problems and I was just sitting on the couch, I'd be upset that I had nothing to do. So 
you know, I really should just be more happy and joyful about these pro these problems that I have. So I just have to come back tomorrow with more gusto. And uh, after the morning show, with Jenny Davis at 7.30 a.m. on Twitch, we will just have to jump back into the list, get caught up and get ahead because Jenny's been hiring salespeople in the background and that's just gonna make my job even harder. <laughs> Oh, I got it! I won! Did you get everything done today you won? Um, for the most part. We were supposed to film more TikToks, but, you know, we had fun <laughs> instead. We did. It was a good time. It was a good time. <laughs> because of everything that's happened today, it reminded me of a sign that was in the bathroom of a Zambian toilet. Oh, so you it. know it's good advice. Yeah, definitely. It says, tomorrow, the best time to do everything you had planned for today. That's what we live so by true. at Jenny and Davis. <laughs> Yeah, that's another day. Thank you so much for watching to the end of the video. We really appreciate all you guys that are watching and helping us, encouraging us. It really means a lot, especially those of you that watch to the end of the videos, hit the like button, hit subscribe. Leave us a comment down below. That really helps. It means it. the world to us. We read all our comments. So thank you so much. Thanks. And until next time, bye. Bye. <laughs>